The sun is rising over the mountains and it's so beautiful. Hey guys and welcome to this video. This time I'm in San Sebastián del Oeste, which is a village located in Jalisco, Mexico. And today I will show you to the places I've seen while visiting this small village surrounded by the mountains. Look how huge this beautiful plant is. So before we move on with the video, I would like to say a big thank you to the people that are part of Beauty and Art family on Patreon. And if you are new on this channel and you would like to stay updated, please consider to subscribe. Thank you very much. I hope you learned something new today. So let's get started. The town is located at an altitude of 1,480 meters and it is a designated Pueblo Magico. It is one of the towns to maintain their historical character. So here we are in the hotel in uh, San Sebastian del Oeste and the view is really nice from here as you can see behind me and there's a, a little terrace here and I will give you a quick tour of the room Oh, hello. Okay, guys, so that's the, um, the hotel room here. It's very nice with a nice view. And this is a small town, so you can hear the roosters in the background. Uh, it's a small town, so we are uh, very close to the square. And uh, at 6, we'll go on the top to see a viewpoint. And it's supposed to be really amazing, so we'll see. This side we have another terrace that we can access. It's a very nice day and we are just walking around a little bit and exploring. So this is the, the main square, just let me show you. Okay hey guys, so here we are at the Pantheon and uh, before we start I would like to say that this doesn't have to be considered as a tourist attraction of course as it is a sacred place, you know, uh, there are uh, mausoleums so uh, they deserve uh, respect
a tree is growing there on the top. It's, uh, it's quite impressive to see how life and trees grow up in, in several places. Like I saw uh, some of my journeys, some unusual places for trees. And this is one of them. This is the power of nature. A beautiful tree that grew up uh, on the rock, on the cliff. So we are on our way to a viewpoint called La Bufa. Reaching the viewpoint La Bufa can be also challenging and tricky if you've never been there before. A local guide, which was very friendly, helped us to get there, and this is what we recommend. Many thanks. Here we are now on the top uh, of this mountain. So look how huge this beautiful plant is. It's called Raisilia. People also rode on it. So we are around uh, 2,500 meters here. So it's foggy, so I don't know how much we'll be able to see. And it is raining a little bit also. Okay, so I think that we are almost there. Will you remember, remember we saw the sun, there was for a moment. I would love to see a little bit uh, of the landscape. Yeah, it's not my first time uh, when we we try to see a, a view from uh, peak of the mountain and we get there and once you get there it's foggy. It also happened in Phan Si Pan in uh, Vietnam. And we hiked uh, to the top and once we were there it was super foggy. So it's like having a flashback with this story. On the way here we saw a lot of beautiful plants and trees. So this is uh, was the view that uh, we had today. This is nature. It is great to be here anyway. So we just make our way back to San Sebastian, to the town.
The tree is a peach tree and it's, it, we have direct access to it from the balcony. It's lovely. Have a look. On the way to another viewpoint, it's uh, closer to the town, and uh, now we'll just go and check it out. This is a, a really amazing point to check out the, the view. There are different uh, species of birds here and there are some lovely zofilotes flying around over the mountains and it is really, really lovely. In case you'd like to learn more about them, please find the link of the documentary in the description below. Only when we connect to nature, engage with nature, are we truly alive and vigorous. To really be alive, one must be under the sun, the moon, the shining stars, and surrounded by the beautiful greenery and poor waters of the natural world. Daisaku Ikeda. And remember, never give up in your dreams. Bye! Please consider to subscribe to this channel if you'd like to see more. Thanks a lot guys and see you in the next video.